is supporting yep. House of Three that we love. We Medify. love Medify. Thank you, Medify, so much. Also, Vivi is a question Medify now. Good for Vivi. Let's go, Vivi. Let's go, Vivi. We take those. So here we go, going over PS2, we have Vivi versus Dill. Uh, Dill, of course, going Rob, and Vivi instead going Hero, because that's the awful matchup. Uh, uh, we're going the Lucario instead, I which I completely agree with. And this, this matchup is kind of like, it goes uh, kind of like both back and forth. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I believe Vivi won last time I was here, it was two weeks ago. So, like, the general, uh, like, post-COVID, uh, well, post-lockdown. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. Vivi kind of had Dill's number and was kind of her demon for a, a good while. Yeah. Dill, in the more recent, has been able to take more games, mm -hmm. but it is a little bit back and forth. Although, it might be my bias as you know her brother, but it kind of feels like Dill has taken a little bit more in recent and stuff like that. So. No, no, Let's I go agree. Dill. I think the past few weeks she's definitely been taking uh, a no few. No bias. Like, no bias. Giving game, Full like, bias. taking Sibling games bias. away from Vivi. Yes. So. You know, hopefully we'll be seeing Vivi use that a lot of that Lucario, the Lucario factor, bro, that aura factor Lucario, uh, against something like Dill. Yeah, I think Lucario and Rob are a little uh, similar in the sense of, like, landing with their nares and getting their, like, imagination, their Build-A-Bear combos, right? I think it's more just, like, this is one of those matchups where, like, if you're not completely on the money with getting your damage and then finding the kill, you are going to burn heavily for it. Right? It's like there's, there's like certain matches where like certain, like characters will build a lot of like Bayonetta, right? She'll build up a lot of damage against her ass character and then like she'll won't be able to find the kill and then she starts start losing. It's like it's like if you're able to do all this damage against Lucario, good, good for you. You got a high two percent. Then if you can't close the stock, you're going to lose. Yeah, right he's now he's chilling with all his rage, and you're gonna be you're gonna be struggling. I know. Vivi has a bunch of rage right now, and Dill had a really good setup going for herself, but I think she didn't have enough. Oh, like, that's gonna kill though. Laser yep. or something to do anything with? Mm -hmm. I couldn't see the animation clearly. Um, but it, it's not mad because Dill took the first dog off of Vivi with, I believe, a throw on the uh, a down on the stage. Mm -hmm. So rest in peace, Vivi. Rest in peace. Now we got Vivi got cast cast start all over again, using that counter to counter build damage as much as he, uh, if they can. Uh, before they started getting more rage oh, going. Oh, that counter's not going to take it. That's weird. That counter, like, it always red sparks. Like, no matter what percent. You could be at zero and so, it'll red spark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It just does that because counters are counters, but um, it's percentage based. Is it? Oh, okay. I don't, so, I don't know how the hell that move works. So basically, Vivi's counter works according to their own percentage. Okay. So that's why it still didn't die at like 105. All right. uh, because BB was only at like 20, 30 something. Mm. Sorry, like 40 something. That's, uh, but that's not, really I, weird. Yeah, so the higher that BB is, that's why, kind of, that's why aura is so important uh, for BB, because the higher you are, your, the better your counter will be and the stronger it will be. Rather than like the, the, the Fire Emblem characters' counters, which are more like yeah. how strong the move is being Yeah, like your back. average counter. Yeah, 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 I get it. This matchup is so weird too. Like I, I'm sitting here, it's like it's like these are two like those volatile characters. Like these are two of the commentators gonna be like, well they're down, but it's Rob, so he can make it back. Same thing with Lucario. I mean he's down, but he has a lot of percentage, so he can come back. It's like, like oh, default, I'm getting out, I'm getting out of the way now. It's like yeah. we're not gonna say that because I already said it. Okay, like. <laughs> Now, now, now that that's out of the way, it's like it's so volatile. It's like if Vivi's able to find these like straight hits with these big percentage, it'll be really good for them. But if Dill is able to find like um, close out these stocks early enough, then Dill's gonna be in a very good position. She'll be able to uh, capitalize very well. We're gonna have to see though. I agree. So Dill is really good at at doing exactly just that. She can if she has a really good opening, she'll just capitalize on it, and it'll take like seventy percent off of like gyro, like the gyro wall and the down tilt, down tilt, down tilt. It's really evil and awful and scary. Um, and also, if Dill has you on the ledge, she'll typically do that the the, the, the Rob side be off the stage in order to capitalize, like to drag you to the bit blast zone. Uh -huh. uh, but Vivi does have, of course, Aura Sphere. He's really, they're really good at uh, identifying a lot of Aura Sphere pressure. That's so big. A lot of Aura Sphere pressure into like a back air or um, the Counter Strike, uh -huh. uh, not Counter Strike, the Palm Strike. Yeah. But unfortunately, VV will not be going back to 0%, and it's going to be very difficult to have any kills unless they have some sort of percentage on them. Exactly. It's like that's, that's, that's the, the, the big Lucario conundrum, right? It's like you have to, to take this, to take socks, you're going to have to, like, take a lot of damage. You're going to have to, like, Lucario, like, a lot of characters are like, oh, you don't want to take too much extra credit on, on, like, being down the stock, right? But, like, Lucario inherently will have to take that damage with extra credit. Like, it's not really extra. It's, it's just normal credit, I guess, Lucario. Like, Lucario, he no needs it, quite literally. This, this is, you need it to pass the class. Yeah, this is just normal stuff, bro. I think Vivi definitely needs to uh, read up on the syllabus right now, because Dill is doing super well, sitting back here, just not dealing with Lucario stuff in the slightest. Just, like, stay away from me. I, I don't want to interact. And 
Please do not there refer to me. Yeah. Oh my god. Good lord. Uh, were you addressing me? Were you addressing me? <laughs> That's what people were saying. No, no. They were like, do, do not refer to me. me. Oh my god, okay. So at 65%, you got last stock, you got a, pretty, a a fair amount of rage, a fair amount of aura, so he could definitely make something happen here. Dill definitely needs to, does not need to get, if you're getting a little too confident against Lucario, you will, you're gonna lose the game, right? You need to sit there, like, okay, I have this advantage, I have this percentage lead, I, I just need to breathe in and I'll be fine. Oh my gosh. It's gonna be scary. Taking 100% once again. He's at 100%, and Dill's going to continue to. Oh, no gyro. Me went no gyro. Uh, but Vivi's definitely going to. Oh, get that's the straight game up right up now. smash. Yeah. Wow, calling so, the bluff on the mash. Yeah, so I think that there's a certain percentage where. Um, you can just do up smash. And yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and Dill definitely knows it better than I. But I've noticed that typically when they're at a high percentage, uh, she'll typically just be like. <laughs> up smash. Yeah, yeah, just, Instead just of just out. waiting for like a mash. Uh, out into up air. Mm -hmm. So I mean, very good stuff from Dildo taking game number one. And we have like five games to play with, or up to five games to play with. So definitely not the end of for Vivi. All they gotta do is really just assess what they got, what, assess the situation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And again, I'm surprised I'm not seeing too much of uh, these auras for pressures on the shield. That's my favorite thing that Vivi does. I think this is th the thing is that so scary is that like. Warrior Sphere Pressure on Shield is like assuming that you're gonna want to get in Rob's face. And like, you get in Rob's face, you kind of do, and you just lose your stock. Just like die. Dill is like, really good at finding those conversions, and just killing you. So like, you don't want that. Uh, Lucario has to hold on to that percentage lead as long as possible. And, and once that goes away, you're like, wow, I'm, I guess I guess I'll die. I guess I'll just have to hold this. All right. Get this back into this game. This is the. Uh, a laser there, still trying to get this damage onto uh, Vivi. Vivi trying to get those low percentage of Lucario. Just that basic stuff, that that, that that training mode dummy type Lucario. Oh no! Okay. No, Vivi knows that setup. Absolutely. Jumps right, right out of it. Does not want me carried into the blast zone that early. Oh! Wait, that's the order you were talking about. That was that could have been sick. I don't I don't even know about this girl. That was that was crazy. What the, oh there we go. wow, very, calling out the uh, killing at 50%. Yeah, that was a hard call that Vivi needs. If you're playing Lucario, you need to get, you need to have you, you gotta have nuts. You gotta have those those big callouts. You gotta be ready for it. Oh, all right. Getting stopped out by the gyro though. And it's up smash. Wow, that's that's, that's, just raw that's crazy. Beautiful. Raw. Hashtag raw. It's like raw. Base Very still cool. up smash. So base, so real. Oh. All right. Okay. Okay. Now we're seeing a little more your share gameplay in this set. Trying to see like uh. Uh, Vivi's like, okay, I'm tired of like, uh, Dill is accustomed to me, like, playing my keep away game. I'm, I'm really, I'm in there, I'm, I'm in your face, I'm doing my damage, I'm, I'm, I'm getting my work in, you know? I got, I got my load cut out for me. Oh, using that down into the ledge, Vivi away. Alright, so we're seeing a really good entrance for it, Dill right now, getting the nair into a, uh, gyro kind of combo going on. And, Vivi. Vivi just really has to work on uh, the keep the keep away game and maintaining it for as long as they can until they're able to get a little bit of aura. Because of course they can take some, they can take like X amount of damage until they have a comfortable amount of aura where they won't die to like Rob F smash, uh -huh. but will survive enough to F smash Rob back. You know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. Oh, like just like that. there goes the F smash it. once again. Look, 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 You're so blessing. smart. Commentary is blessing. You're so intelligent. Bro, I, I just know my friends. I know my friends. You should have said like you're I just know them. Right away. You could have just taken. You could have said you were smart. Right uh, no, 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 no. I am. Not, I'm, I'm a I little. Know them. I'm a little dumb. I know them. I'm a little dumb, but I know them. I, like, I may be stupid, but I'm not dumb. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Still not even able to uh, finish this edge guard here. Oh no. That back air from Vivi is going to be so hurt so bad. At this high percentage, it's very difficult for someone to uh, catch Vivi's uh, extreme speed as they're trying to recover. Just because Vivi's very, very efficient at uh, maneuvering the their extreme speed around your opponent. Yeah. So you don't want to get caught with the arm rotor off stage. You don't, you don't want to get caught with anything off stage. Uh, so Vivi's playing a very good game. And a little bit of Orisker pressure, that I was talking about earlier, but right here, might not take it. Yeah. Okay, up until, uh, definitely up gonna air, take it. definitely take it, yeah. Very good stuff. Vivi. It's sitting comfortably, but not really. Like you have, okay, you have the lead on the last side, but like your Lucario at that low percent, it's like against Rob with the high percent. It's like you don't have really your aura to, to threaten Rob right now. 
Dillish is kind of chilling for, for at least another 20%. And I'm seeing that uh, Dill is trying to get this gyro setup going for herself, where she's able to down to you back and forth against the gyro. Oh. But at least the gyro is there as a, as, a, as, a, as, a, as like a wall, like a threat. Like if you go over here, you're going to get hit. Oh no. And finally getting the Aura Sphere onto Dill, one, Dill 130%. Uh, not the, outside the wrong possibility. However, she has to be able to really capitalize on an up. Ooh, uh, another my, up no! Air. Oh my god, the air dodge! Oh, oh the, the, sw yep. the sour spot. Oh my That's god, it. V, don't deal! Oh, she's v, v is gonna, still alive! She's been the stage and not oh my being god. able to capitalize on it, unfortunately. Dill, you're crazy. Dill's fine. A little, bit a little bit of a high recovery. Big old laser and avoiding this or is the oh, no, the talking about. The shield. There that's it is. so unfortunate. That's what I was talking wow. about. Wow. Vivi's happy about that one. Yeah, Thank that's, you game number two. So that's what I meant by Aura Sphere Pressure. That is what Vivi typically does. I'm sure a lot of the cards do, where they do a lot, uh, like they go backwards, they do a lot of pressure on your shield with the damage of charging up Aura Sphere. Mm -hmm. And typically, Vivi can do it like while he's jumping as well, but they just kind of went right into the B reverse. Uh, yeah. And just boom, bomb, bam, straight bomb. up. Bada ba boom pow. That's literally ba ba boom pow. Like ba da ba boom. Just want to say for the reference for the chat, we're it fun. ended on even. Anyway. Hey, what? Uh, we're playing evens and odds with the timer. Oh, uh, yeah, without us? We gambling in the chat. Boo. Without gambling. us? Boo, boo. <laughs> no, we love gambling no, in this house. No, gambling's haram. No. Shh. Bad. You're gambling good. No. Take All right, uh, casters. Yes? Will the second be even or odd? Which side? Like, like the main second or the middle second? The second, not uh, the middle. Odd, <laughs> odd, odd. I say odd. All right, I guess I'm going to eat. I, I thought even anyways. All right, All right. shake. Shake. For well, absolutely for nothing. nothing. For absolutely shake. Nothing. Shake. For absolutely nothing. For, for bragging rights. You're type. You're yeah. You're for bragging rights. Yes. <laughs> All right. I'm going odd. back into this game number three. Oh. All right. You get, just yeah. Just yeah. VB, like what we said earlier with that that um. That a confidence of holding with a drop gyro, right? Kind of just throwing it out there, like, hey, I don't want anybody to have the gyro right now. I, I want the uh, nonsense out of here. I have my own combos. I I'm not worried about your your Rob weirdness, right? Oh, uh, all right. Maybe they should be a little bit. I'm just, 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 just slightly just, poking just, the gyro just towards the slightest Dill. bit. Just to like, just like, stop it for a second. Just engine your way. Uh oh, oh no, Rob, oh, Rob the... got gas. What's going on? No. Dill, what are you doing out there? What are so, you doing out there? Dill's so not happy Vivi about that one either. So, was challenging Dill off the stage, and Dill was trying to protect themselves. And, of course, unfortunately, that up to that she did, or upper that she did, uh -huh. just was like, Vivi was like, hey, I'm going I'm to come down, actually. No. I, I don't mess with that Rob down. Yeah. That's not cool. And there was no, like... There was a tech, a tech situation in that moment, but I, I, I personally would have found it. Like, I, I, I would have not have reacted in time to tech that. I, me, personally, I'm not... I would tech that. Oh, my bad. Uh, yeah. So if you're like, no, you just, Momo, you just, like, you know, you attack those. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You always, you always attack those. Yeah. I, I believe you. Got on Yeet Smash for teching sometime, one time. That you were on Yeet Smash for teching? For teching, yes. That's fun. It was a really, I need to show you the, that was a, it was a good tech. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways, enough about tech. Oh, that oh. back air. That's not going to take it. That was a, that was a big, no, it meaty was big. back air. It was, it was there, but I think it was because it was in the middle of the stage. Oh, Phoebe no. could survive oh. a little bit longer. BB dash running back a little bit just to get away from the area of that down smash. Okay, the down oh. smash. That's One not going to take time. it. Oh, no. BB at full rage. Oh, no. Oh, oh yeah. So okay. Vivi Unfortunate. Full gyro. Yeah, you're getting that. I mean, that was Scout was ready to see Vivi with full rage, but I guess not. That's for another day, I guess. All right. You're just trying to get that, uh, trying to, trying to chilling with this lead right now. Just, just kind of playing a little passive, saying like, "Hey, like I'm ready to take this damage, but I also want to, I want to get a little more damage on you." you know? That was beautiful. The, the I, I think it was like three or four down tilts into like the back hit of Nair, uh, which is like, wow. Okay, hi. Okay. Oh. Uh, if we're playing good old fashioned neutral. We're, we're, we're good. Old, oh my gosh, that's Gyro putting a stop to that aura pressure right there. Very good. Stuff. Oh, the upbeat, the, the landing hit from the uh, upbeat was very huge. The down smash is not going to take it though. That was huge though. Dill just floating to the top of the stage, just saying, hey, like, I'm, I'm out of here. I'm not, I don't want to interact with you anymore. Do not do not refer to me. Do not edge guard me. Do not ledge trap me. Uh, edge, edge, uh, countering that. Um, oh, oh you're, no. You're, no. You're good, you're good. It was the last hit left that side of the stage. This is so scary. Oh, trying to get that back here there. One VV at 141. If Dill can take the stock now, he'll be fine. Oh my gosh. Not getting hit with the, the grab of side, but still getting hit by the end hit. That end hit coming in so clutch for VV at 141%. The gyro the saving gyro Dill. Eating the aura. Okay, now I'm not going to eat that one, though. Mm -hmm. You get out of there. 
still, you're in such a bad spot. At one, Lucario's at 151. You need to take a stock now. Oh no! Oh. You don't. You don't want that big Orister eating you off the ledge. Oh my God. A little bit of Orister pressure. Okay, now you're dead though. You're dead Goodbye. Yep, 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 yep. Good stuff from Dylan. I'm taking too much damage in that uh, Max Rage Lucario. Oh, he, ooh, what is this? Okay. Vivi's just going in. Vivi's going in. That was, not that was cute. That was quirky. Okay, Vivi. I just did really the parry too. The laser. Vivi's feeling, feeling themselves right now. This is, this is crazy. Oh. All right, throwing out these auras figures, trying to uh, get this started. Oh no, I was—I was, honestly, I was too accustomed to like the back throw and like Nair. I was like, uh oh, I, I saw it and I was—I I, kind of like, I was scared. Oh, all right, landing with that here. Trying to find a good opening here. We're just playing that that good old fashioned neutral. Yeah. Not crazy play, going on here. We're really just trying to find an opening just to secure some kills. So we'll have a big, big last stock, really. We're just relaxed. This is a little like a little the elevator music time. We're playing we're playing nooch. Uh oh, okay, that down seems to be very was, good for right there. That was funny. <laughs> Thank you. Oh no. It's not gonna kill, but that's it's putting really bad position. Oh no, the tech position! Oh, I was expecting that full commitment on that, that aura sphere on shield. Oh no! This okay. is huge for Dill. She's able to get, not get the up smash, unfortunately, <laughs> off the platform. However, she can get a really good uh, down throw into up tilt, into smash, maybe even up smash at this point. And another, uh, if, oh! if she's able to get uh, Vivi off the stage like, like she did earlier, and get a really good a side rotor, maybe, or arm rotor, be really good too. Oh no. Are we see up smash? No, we're not! No, is, You're dead, is, though. Yeah. You're dead. Oh, so, so I, I'm trying to see the percentage of when she'll typically go into up tilt, into up air, or up smash. I think BB, I guess I guess under 100 might be good for uh, going into up tilt, into up air. Yeah. Amazing stuff for that, BB that's catching that's that's that like up tilt, up air. Oh my gosh. The Rob Classic. Classic guy. Where'd my pen go? There it is. It's right there. Yes. Hey, bestie. There's, 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 Even. There's better pens in here. Yeah. He's dead? No, they're on. This is for you. Yeah, I need to charge those pens. Uh, it's been a while. Are these like the... What kind are these? They're just powered styluses. Oh. If they have a brand name, I don't know what it is. It's called the user manual. Yeah. Yes. RTF. Shout out to user manual. Shout out to user manual active capacitive pen. I feel like I, spelled, I said that wrong. Oh, let, me, let me see it. Capacitive? Yeah, capacitive. I said that, yeah. Okay, good. Sometimes yes. I'm just care about my English. You got even twice in a row. What do you mean? Like you, you got better English than I do. And English is my first language. I have to learn. <laughs> I know. I'm saying you got better I'm saying it's like you got better I, I, English I than I do. I have to learn, like, the rules. Because my teacher was a little bit crazy. Oh, I mean, yeah, well, I, I know the feeling. Yeah. Okay. No more trauma, it's time for Smash Bros. Yeah! Trauma where? He's yeah. great. Ooh, ooh. No, not, not uh, during June. No. I miss school, not gonna lie. I guess like regular high school. Oh, yeah, yeah, not the novel thing. That not. was easy. Oh, that was college hard. Yeah, it was college, college, no. And it was difficult. Is VV coming in the way that they want to? Dill has a really good, really good control center stage right now. Even, like, even the edge at this point. Um, and. Is it. Is it a little choppy for you? I uh, the slightest bit, yeah. I, I just noticed that. It's alright though. Yeah, it was just your stuff. Oh, okay. Just, just, a, just a spurt. It's okay. We're it's be technical Gucci, difficulties. Be Gucci, be Gucci. We're cool. We're cool. Alright, here goes that Oris here again. I don't know if, if he knew. That's all. Alright, be Gucci. Oh, I love that animation for for Rob. Where he just doesn't have a gyro. He's like, he's oh, just like, damn it. Like, dang it. Yeah. And there goes there goes Dill's dog. Yeah. You can just hear me. He's like, yeah. Yeah, basically what just ha what had just happened is no gyro. VB's doing a little bit of aura charging and got a really good forest smash off of that. Nice. Dill's just waiting, just like mm -hmm. sitting there with the gyro trying to get it started. Oh, this aura sphere kind of sitting here though. Oh my gosh, the gyro was huge. But that was the the stuff I was waiting for. Unfortunately, uh, the beat just kind of fell out of it. Okay, but then they finally gained the side rotor or the side B arm rotor, whatever. Catching uh, catching the landing there from Vivi and Dill taking that stock and getting back to even stocks. This, this is where Rob, this is where Dill is, uh, tends to strive, right? Yep. It, these even percentages, these even these low percentages here, like with this Rob. Obviously, Vivi's still try, uh, starting to like slowly but surely like adapt to these situations. Right? Like, obviously, Lucario's going to be chilling at the high percent a lot of the time, but it's like 
I mean, Vivi can make this happen though. Vivi is not no one trick pony. This is uh, this is the Lucario we're talking about. All right. Going to the top of the screen, see if we can just can capture this uh, yeah, landing she'll, here. She'll typically go for like a high recovery, um, just to avoid most, if not all, like characters. But Lucario is one of the characters that can definitely Ooh. chase you in the air, just like Falco can as well. Or it's uh, a big damage really right there. This is so scary. I mean, I was 78% there. Oh, oh it's falling call out because the back air dragged her off the platform. Unfortunate, but true. But did, did Vivi just wants to take the stock now. Does not want to chill on this percent any longer with Dell. You know, it's very scary. Dell's going for some crazy stuff to set up, and she's she's looking. She's she she's red right now. We're seeing that down tilt too. Oh my God. Dill is going in. down tilt, and thankfully missing the uh, attack right there from Vivi. We're gonna be going into oh, no. a pummel into the ground and up tilt. And Wait for the air dodge, and we'll find the up smash though. No, that's okay. We're gonna do it again. One more time into oh. up smash. Ba -ba yep. yep. So yeah, see you at the at, like at the, like 120 though, like get up smash. Okay, I see now. Uh, Vivi possibly sitting on his uh sitting on their tournament stock right now. I mean, obviously this is Lucario though, so like this advantage isn't real. Disadvantage isn't real. This it can't hurt you. Disadvantage is the, is the advantage. I just want to point out, uh, down throw berry uh, to up smash for like 90% of people uh, is like kind of a combo until 160. Oh. He just, he just mashed really slow. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, it's pretty easy to get out of one point. Well, you know. Uh, wow, well, the only I, people I, who get it, Devin, like, yeah. you can mash, right? No, you're cool. You're I, cool. Yeah. The only people who can get out at like 160 is like numbers. Oh, okay. That but, makes, that makes first, sense. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yes. I saw a pattern for like three rounds. So I was like, okay, that must be it. Yeah. Never mind. I mean, maybe Vivi has like a not great mash. I don't know. We're gonna have to. Yeah, we'll, uh, maybe Vivi, maybe he's just playing the, the mind games. Uh, you can never really tell with these these crazy good players. Dill just kind of chilling at the top of the screen, like, hey, like, all right, yeah, getting caught with that Orsi. Really so, spear finally. Orsi doing so much work for Vivi in this matchup. I mean, down by 66 percent, but like this is all uh -oh, part with uh -oh. our oh my 37 percent. Vivi wants to hang on to this tournament stock, wants to stay in this game, wants to take us to game five. But Dill just wants to find, she wants to find that combo to take Vivi out now. He's not wanting Vivi anymore. This high percent, this aura is just doing too much for him. Oh no! Oh, oh huge. my god! That's huge! That's amazing! That's huge! That's You're huge. dead. That's that huge. It? That's wow. huge. Hold on. Instant replay. Instant replay. I don't care about player cams. Get out of here! Wow. Oh, she just like casually drinking her water. No, yeah. that was that was the last time she. Oh, okay. Was, I mean, wow. I just go. want like first of all, evil. No. Second of all, no. Let's go back really fast. Just half speed a little bit. So we see the extra damage. I was talking about this earlier. The gyro setup or whatever. The extra damage. Thank you. Uh, from the gyro while she's also like pummeling Vivi mm -hmm. is evil because that's just added damage that Vivi just did not need to their stock. Uh huh. And. I think the fact that that's, that's look how much damage look look, look at this bro, it's just like you just you just you just it's so GG. much yeah shake my hand look the air dodge also there once you want to Vivi. get the get the conversion not the conversion getting uh the grab off of the gyro hit well it goes to 122 and then you're getting extra hits from the gyro which you see right here a little like slash mark that mm -hmm. says the gyro then you pummel into the ground and then the fact that you can like recognize I can't do it. Because there's a lot of things going on on the screen. Mm -hmm. But the fact that Dill can recognize the mash and know exactly what to do, just gain a, uh, the up air. And then, yeah. And gain the final kill. Looks like an up smash. That was, I, that's I, it. I can't, I can't <laughs> see the match. Like, I, I kind of want to point out. I can't do hold it. Hold on. I can't do it. Look at the, uh, the, it's not really a DI line. It's more of a launch angle line. But, like, look at this. We'll put it in extra slow. But, like, look at where it goes. Left, right. Left. This is a good visual uh, of like how Rob's up air works. Yeah, oh, Lord. seeing like each and arm. Yeah, no, this. Devin, Devin. This, this blue line right here. Devin. Is, is DIing Rob up air real? Is I DIing mean, Rob up air real? Yes. You're lying. So, like. So you're lying. I mean. Misinformation. Okay. Joe, meme answer, no. But, meme like, answer. you know, the idea is that, like, the, the left arm hits to the right, and then the right arm hits to the left. No. Okay, fine. <laughs> no. The left arm is to the left, and the right arm hits yeah, to the it right. It hits cross up, so it's, it's like fair. really annoying. I don't want to yeah. think about directions, man. I'm gonna be sitting there like getting hit by Rob. I'm gonna be like putting up the L's, just like. Yeah. Before this next game, can we take?